is how that sums up uh, that up. That was that was tough. Harder than I thought. I knew it was going to be hard because of the headwind out, but that was harder than I thought. Yeah. Um, little tip: what you want to do, you want to get a nice little flannel like this, and you want to get your body cologne, which you get over in Mallorca or over in Spain. You can get them out of supermarkets for like one euros. So they're brilliant. Bring that with you. And you can just give yourself a little alcoholic wash down. Make yourself smell nice, take all the sweat away. But, um, yeah, that was really tough. Yeah, uh, 10 miles, 19 minutes, 15 seconds. Uh, for those of you that like your power figures, here you go. Uh, 368 watts, which uh, gives me 5.2 or 5.3 watts per kilo. So it's a little bit down on what I can do. But, um, 1915. I was hoping for a long 18. Just too windy. Just too windy. So yeah, as you can see, we're in the car. Preparation, preparation, preparation. So uh, we're now on the post-workout routine. So we're gonna have a protein shake now, and then I've got about a 50-minute drive home, uh, where I'll get home, quick shower, and actually I'm gonna go and meet another mate who's been racing today up in uh, up near Birmingham somewhere. So I'm gonna go and have uh, dinner out with him, try and keep it healthy, uh, chicken and veg, salmon and veg, something like that. And then uh, I'm gonna to ride tomorrow morning, see how I feel, either we do a recovery ride or um, or maybe just, uh, you know, two, three hours or whatever, you know, level two, something like that. But um, Here we go, that's time trialing, you know. Um, diet and everything got pretty good. Uh, I think that worked okay. Um, yeah, get home and watch the Vuelta, see how those boys are done. And uh, thanks for watching. See you at the next video. Bye.